We hope y'all had a good Labor Day. We got us some cool shirts. That Kentucky Lake and Fat Daddy on them. Uh, just got a nice hoodie that has a sweatshirt hoodie, I guess, or a just regular long sleeve shirt hoodie. Reggie found a friend. Look at that statue. That looks just like Reggie. We had to go home with it. It was only $15, but oh man, it was it was worth it. So. Look at this puppy. He's so sweet and so cute. Yeah, that's Reggie. He's a good Reggie. There's Captain Spot. We love him still dearly. But more 3D printing going on. <sighs> had a lot of failures of some other ones. I had a cable. This cable right here that was wrapped around was going on the other side and somehow was loosening that knob back there to the point where it falls off and it causes it all to fail so that happened twice so I figured it out <sighs> other than that car is still obsolete waiting for the parts to get here um, haven't done much of anything other than just getting a few things done here and there for work I uh, went and hung out with mom on the boat yesterday for Labor Day so that was fun uh, other than that just still getting more work done but once we get more done, we'll let y'all guys see what we got. One quick note, also before, I gotta go get my cortisone shot today in my back. So we're gonna get to see if that's gonna help me out in the future. If not, I don't know, gonna be screwed. Just gotta deal with the pain. So let's go to the doctor. Gotta head to Paducah now. Didn't realize it was already time to go, so. Woo. Oh, welcome back to Beast Mode on the Road where every day is a fucking annoyance. So today, was a clog I got this almost done it was like the last couple of hours from a 20 something hour print so I got mad and crushed it but it kept doing that right there it wouldn't seal and it had a clog so now I'm trying to diagnose it and figure it out after I waste more fucking filament like Filament's not cheap, and I'm not happy about wasting hours of my fucking life trying to do this shit. Like, that makes me so mad. So, trying to figure this out. Gotta watch a bunch of YouTube videos on it. Like, it's annoying as fuck. But June's down there working on fursuits and some kigus. I'm sitting here trying to get our 3D printer to work so we can print some eyes out eventually and make sure it works 100%. So... I don't know it sucks so figured it's the hot end getting creep or hot creep or whatever up to here it's long prints I need to make sure this tube is all the way down but just just a bunch of bullshit so I don't know we'll see what this we found out made and the last one you saw me making was this one and it had the little bit of warpage right there you can see but overall still did its job then a five piece uh, or five square hallway it came out great uh, one square hallway two square hallway one square dead end all came out great but something with these big long prints does not like and like this one came out great like I don't know so I'm still fighting the printer getting it back leveled I've cleaned out the nozzle I've taken the PTFE out, it's this tube right here, and cleaned it, made a new spot for it at the, at the bottom, so I cleaned it off and jammed it back in the hole, uh, so, uh, uh, just pain in the butt, and we're still waiting for the O-ring for the car, so I can fix it. So many things I gotta fix and do around here. It's awful. But it's the same as any house and I brought it upon myself so I can live a modest, cheap, easy life. So gotta fix everything because it breaks constantly. Even with new stuff. New stuff breaks down all the time too. Like Eric's RV is breaking down left and right if you watch his channel. But man, 
it's just a bummer because I still got a bunch of load of stuff to do on my RV and the car got all these commissions to get out so eh, we'll get through it so stay tuned Woo! welcome back to beast mode on the road because <laughs> we get everything done here <laughs> not really but I uh, got this thing printed again it's doing all right now got a clog just <laughs> all I can do is wish for another clog not to happen but bummer but I've been learning how to make donuts and doing 3d again in blender I haven't touched blender in probably seven years since I was in college so doing a crash course learning all the new stuff again uh, gotta be able to make eyes for our uh, pre-made fursuits we're gonna be doing in the future I think that's gonna be kind of cool uh, then the heads too we're gonna uh, expand foam cast them just need to be able to make a solid base so we can make a mold from it and yeah future and just waiting for this thing to kick over and I'm gonna start another print doing a bunch of small ones because good god I've got like six big ones that take over 16 hours each and it's not going very well thread breaks that breaks clogs so uh we'll get through it so catch us when we get more done spooky that is one dark and spooky driveway and you wonder why i come running up it <laughs> <laughs> running, running and screaming <laughs> but yeah. mm -hmm. jojo's still in the bag but well, we got tails for floki and Raver Lion. Yep. Yay. And here's, uh... Jojo's body is getting ready. Those are going to be taken with us the next time we go to mom's to work in the basement. Dakota's tail, his yeah. hair. Mm -hmm. I'm doing his ears right now. Uh, Ta da. Um, and then bird ear moth. <laughs> <laughs> and. Then I have M stuff right there, but I think I might call it for tonight. I'm getting kind of hungry and a little sore. Okay. I'm not sure what we want to have for dinner, but we'll get something. <laughs> we'll figure it out. We always do. Reggie wants tacos. Reggie wants tacos. I want tacos. Well, I guess we're going to go have some tacos. <laughs> so, we'll see what we get done for the rest of the night and catch y'all tomorrow. printing this one has been taking me forever third time's a try so 18 hours in one more hour to go and it's already at the very end so even if it failed right now I'd still be able to use it so successful we finally got it done well that one done uploading some videos waking baby up look at that Reggie look at that Reggie dog Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Rosal Reggie. Reggie, you ready for some coffee? Yeah. You want some coffee? Want some puppy coffee? I see your tail flapping. I see your tail flapping. Let's go make some coffee, Reggie. Woo! It's another great morning on Beast Mode on the Road. Doing more 3D printing. This thing just won't stop. So. We're keeping it on, keeping it on, making some coffee, watching some YouTube, waking up them, and well, parents still have bronchitis, so we won't be over there for a while still, and we need to go get some water, so I'm going to do that today. Uh, other than that, we got Pretzel's body going, it's looking really good, so hopefully it'll be ready to go here soon. Mm. Be working on some more key goose, that's pretty much it. Late spooky night going down to the property. Spooky, spooky, spooky. Just got rid of a bunch of 
old fabric and trying to clean out the well, trying to clean out the camper a little bit got a lot of the scraps out and getting some of the bodies organized and there's baby there's Reggie getting things out the cube wall has currently tried to start collapsing so we are uh yeah, time down for it <laughs> yep. okay. there's a floor you can see back there now three and getting some furs ready for the next big body project so uh, a lot of stuff yeah it's not falling off the roof or the side of the wall yet so uh, it was it was <laughs> It was encroaching this far, so <laughs> slowly over the last week or so, it's just been like, <laughs> joy. So, yeah, getting things taken care of down here at the uh, camper studio. So, yep, got some bodies ready to go. Got JoJo's body. Got his leg right over here. Can't really see it very well, but it's there. There's him in a bag. Cool. If you guys could have seen it. Yeah. It looks pretty good. Forgot to bring the camera down here. But well, we're gonna finish cleaning up and go head up top. Probably watch a movie and relax for the rest of the night. See you guys next time.